Hello Bethlehem friends, near and far. If we've not had uh, a chance to meet yet, uh, I'm Pastor Rick Mylander and I have the privilege of being your transitional interim pastor here at Bethlehem. Gail and I returned uh, overnight last night from visiting our daughter's family in Alaska, as most of you who are near know. Uh, and though we had a great time with our kids and our grandkids, our hearts were very much with you here and we were eager to get home. We are very glad to be back, but what a crazy difference a single week can make. It seemed for a while there, late in the week, that uh, things were changing from hour to hour with pronouncements being made that would be rescinded even a couple of hours later. And by, all, by now, we all know the severity of what we are facing. You've heard it already many times, but it will always bear repeating. From 2 Timothy chapter 1, verse 7, where it says, For God did not give us a spirit of cowardice or fear, but rather a spirit of power, of love, and of self-discipline. We're all learning what self-discipline will be required of us as we face this challenge. But as we do that, please constantly remind yourselves also to lean into God's power and God's love. These are the things that will get us through. There's so much that could be said, but I will keep it brief. Pray. Trust God. Care for yourselves. But also, please give care to others. We'll have some ideas for this uh, in the next few days. But for now, uh, please call or email the church office and let us know if you have a need. And we will do our best to get that uh, any help that we can to you quickly. But also contact the church if you can help meet the needs uh, of others. Some of you need to shelter in place. And some of you have the capacity to help those who need to shelter in place. So please, call or email the church if you have a need or if you can help meet a need. It's important that you know that we will follow official directives to not gather in groups of 10 or more. So with that in mind, we need to clearly state uh, what you already assume, that we will not be sharing public worship service this coming Sunday morning, nor until further notice. That's a hard thing for us to continue to say, but it is our reality. The staff and I are working on recording something that we can all share on Sunday morning, and more info will be coming to you uh, later in the week about this as we progress. We're also moving toward a goal of eventually live streaming worship uh, from church here via our Facebook page, but do not yet have everything in place to be able to do that. If you are not yet on Facebook, I want to please ask that you can do what you can to get it. Call the church if you need help. It's not a, a difficult thing. If you are online, it's easy to get. Our church's Facebook name is Bethlehem Covenant Church dash Minneapolis. That's all you need to know. You can find it easily in that way. I do believe you'll, uh, you can request friendship and that will then be approved by someone here at the office. The fact is that right now, whether you have been exposed to COVID-19 or not, every single one of us has been exposed to the fragility and the preciousness of life. Every single one of us has had our supposed certainties exposed. And every single one of us is nakedly exposed to our desperate need for God. Simply, may we never be the same again. And may God use this to his glory. Thank you, and God bless you.